Have you ever wondered how many moles do you have on your body? A mole refers to any dark pigmentation spot on your skin. Each of us, without being noticed, we can have at least 10 up to 100 of these moles scattering all over our bodies. But usually, we just don't care about them. Why? Because most of them are harmless and possess only the cosmetic concern. However, due to mutation and some genetic factors, some of these moles may silently develop into a very little type of skin cancer, the melanoma, which causes more than 75% death in all skin cancer cases. The disease progression of this melanoma is correlated to the depth and thickness of a mole underneath our skin. That's why it is very difficult to identify a cancerous mole by visual inspection even if you are a very experienced doctor. The only way to diagnose a melanoma is to surgically remove a biopsy sample and study under the microscope in the lab. As this procedure is very slow and invasive, it is impossible for us to examine every mole on our body. So over my PhD project here, I have been working on the development of a non-invasive optical biopsy method that can measure the depth and thickness of a mole rapidly. A miniature handheld probe has been built in our lab with a very special cone shell configuration as shown on the slides. With this ice cream cone light detection configuration, when we measure from deep tissue, lesser signal from the surface will be excited and detected, hence achieving excellent depth sensitivity. Besides that, with the incorporation of an axicon lens, we can change the focal depth of this probe conveniently without the need to move it up and down. That means, by just placing the probe gently on our skin, we can scan a mole in a vertical direction and read out the thickness and depth of it within just a few seconds. With a probe like this, a doctor can examine every mole on the patient within just a second, accurately, rapidly, consistently, and the most important thing is non-invasively. With this probe, it will definitely improve the speed of diagnosis and provide vital diagnostic information for the treatment planning of melanoma. And with the invention of this depth-sensitive probe, I hope that the mortality rate of the so-called deadly melanoma can be brought down. Thank you. Thank you.